Right, I thought we'd have a little look at this Malibu Carthago. And uh, it's 86,000. It's 8,000 pounds off this, so that's t price at the moment 78,995 at Tyne Valley Motorhomes. And like I say, we had a look at Carthago at Todd's, and I was quite impressed. And I think a lot of people who saw the video yeah. like what they saw yeah. as well. We would go down the outside first. Yeah, we'd have yeah. a little wander around the outside. And the great thing about these is the massive locker. I have to get them to open it, but it has got a huge locker there. Tow bar. Tow bar on this Tow one. Bar. Yeah. <laughs> Reversing camera up the top there. Nice alloys. Oh, this is nice. Sit yourself down. Social little lounge. Yeah. It? Yeah. Yeah, very comfortable. A drop down bed at the front. This is a manual, isn't it? Six speed manual. Uh, yes. Yes. Yeah. You get this fantastic view. Don't yeah. You, well, you front. get such a nice wide cab area, don't you? It's much more like being in a caravan with the open open cab at the front. This is very comfortable, this chair. Yeah. Very nice. And a little, little table there, you can move about. I think that's that's fixed, isn't it, the table there. How do you get in there then? It's well, there's fixed. a button underneath. I think there's a button on the floor. On the floor, right. You press that down and then you can move the table around. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's coming. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, so you can centre it for everybody. Yeah. And you've got the lockers at the side here, so you can put bits and maps and things in there. There's a nice big locker at the side so it's not wasted space there. No. You've got the, your reversing camera in the corner. Yeah, very nice. And it's got actually funny enough it's got the old style, I suppose that was with the Continental vans, you've got the locker at the front which yes. I prefer, I actually prefer that. Because you've got loads of storage there. You've only got one yeah. cup holder, haven't you? Yeah, well, I'll get rid of that and put my USB thing, thing in there. These thing in there, so you won't have any cup holder. No, no. Have you got nice... Well, you've uh, got cup holder down the side of you. If you look down the side here, the other side. Other side. Down there. Oh, we've got one down there. Yeah, speakers in the door. Oh, yeah, you have, yeah. haven't you? So you don't need that, then. You've got the, the other exit door on that side. Yeah. So you don't really have to worry about getting out to the wrong side. No. Because that's quite a low door. Yeah. This is a Pioneer unit. And it's a Pioneer unit, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And I think that's the sat nav unit as well. Yeah, I would imagine it is. I think it's that one we've looked at before. Yeah. You were interested in. Yeah. Got some speak nice speakers down the bottom. Yeah. There. Yeah. Either side. I'm just moving round now. Okay, so what we got? Three burner hob. Here with a cast iron grill cover. A feature of these is this pull out uh, chopping board type thing. You can turn over. over. Yeah. And you can use as a shelf as well. Oh, that's right, yeah. You put them in there as a shelf. Yeah, which is a better idea really than a, a separate one, isn't it? Because then you end up with like two things that yeah. you take off. Well, there. that's right. You've got, to, yeah. you've got to find somewhere to put them, haven't you? Then? Yeah. So. That's nice. Yeah, you've got a little oven on, on these, a little combi oven. You wouldn't be doing a lot of cooking, would you? No. Well, you've got enough there with the hob, probably. I'd have to, you'd have to see how you get on with that sort of oven, wouldn't you? Have a look at the cupboards. Because you didn't come with me when we, I looked at the no, Cathago. No, 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 I didn't. Not Cathago, the Malibu. Malibu. It was a handy spoon. <laughs> <laughs> and a flipper. Yeah, and a flipper. And some tea spoons yeah. and a pen. And a pen. What could you want? some glasses in there and a kettle. Yeah. So this is fully, yep, so this is fully, fully equipped. equipped isn't it? Isn't oh, it? We're off then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
These are covers are sort of like at an angle, aren't they? Yeah, they've got like a yeah. See, they catch there. They've got that sort of catch. So yeah. I've wrapped the um, plates. Yeah, so they don't rattle. Yeah, it's a good idea, isn't it? Good idea. Yeah. Yeah. Well equipped. What sort of fridge have we got? Slimline, isn't it? Slimline fridge. Yeah, it's not. It's not a huge fridge, is it? But uh, again, it's smaller than it's. It's larger than the little Dometic ones, isn't it? The, the manual yes. manual energy selection fridges. It's an automatic selection, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. What's in there? Just let me <laughs> check that. Yeah, yeah, it's an automatic energy selection. <laughs> Phew. <laughs> what is in there? Nothing's in there. That looks like a door, doesn't it? What's, is that just a light switch? That's a light switch. Okay, <laughs> alright then. Ooh, that's different. Yeah, they've got a circular door here. Let me go and clip it. And that folds out to keep the sink and the toilet. And there's another one that slides around. I won't do it all, but yeah. yeah. Different idea. Yeah, different idea. And it's quite a, it's quite a, it's a small um, bathroom. I'm going to say bathroom. It's a small shower, but you've got quite a big sink area there. You've got a huge mirror. <laughs> yeah, great big mirror. Oh, uh, blinded by the sun there. And another cupboard on this side. It's got another mirror on it as well. Yeah, it's got a mirror on it, so oh. you can watch yourself watching yourself, <laughs> watching yourself. Yeah, more cupboards in there and little cubby holes in the corner. So it's not, it's a nice bathroom. What's that? You've got a toilet brush, you don't see that very often. No, that's right, a little toilet brush. Yeah. And two drainers. Yeah, I was looking at that, there's one there and... Yeah, either side. Either side, which is better Which than really helps, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I still think there's something in there. It's no, it's not. just... <laughs> but it's the shower, isn't it? It's the it? shower unit, yeah, yeah. Right. So, here we are. This is the bed. Yeah, so you've got a hanging space there. Can't see the hanging rail at the moment. Yes, it's there. I can see it. Mm. That side. And you've got the same the other side. Yeah, there's plenty of space there. You've got access to the water tank there as well. Why does it say lift on both of them? I'll show you in a minute. All oh, right, okay. Got access to the water tanks, fresh and waste. Oop. And if you lift this up, right, you can get to your hanging. Thing, you get to your hanging way. space from. Well, that's clever. You don't be fancy climbing no. under there, do you? No, because you just drop it in there, can't you? And you notice the beds are on slats rather than flat. Mm. And that's important if you're above a garage because you can get condensation if you don't have a space between the top of the garage yeah. and the bed. Little lockers all round, but plenty of room for so your smalls and things and socks. Socks, loads of socks. There we go. On in. Um, a sitting up room, nice mirror sort of effect there. You've got reading lights either side, empty, sp empty space there in the shelves. But you see what they've done there? They've put like a little on retainer the, yeah, there on the auto cruise. That's what we had, wasn't yeah. It? yeah. We had an open shelf, we had bars like that, yeah. So if you put pillars or something in there, they're yeah. not going to come out, no, no. Got USB something under there. There's that USB. Oh yeah, the USB just there. That's good. Curtains, neck curtains. And you've got the blinds as well. That's great. I, I do like this fan a lot. Yeah, I thought you did. What, what is that there? This. This is for sliding the. Yeah, slide that out. Right, and then. That in and, and then you can drop that in there and that makes a big, big a big bed. bed right yeah excellent 
So you've still got the same number of steps, but obviously... You've got a bigger bed, so... Three in a bed. You know how the third one would be, Coffee. don't you? <laughs> Excellent. Yeah, very nice. I do like this. Yeah. Holstery on there. Got your controls under this little frosted panel. It's Truma blown air, and you've got this uh, Malibu control unit, and it's got the satellite unit there as well. See the satellite unit? Oh, the controller, the satellite on, on here. Ooh. Yeah. Very nice. But you don't want to leave now, do you? No, no, I've got to just stay in here. But it's stopped raining, hasn't it? Yeah, so, so it might go out then. Yeah. Yeah, they've got all the supplies in here, so I won't show you all these cans of beer in here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, obviously, you've got a bit of a lip there, but it does allow you to get to things, doesn't it? Yeah, you? but you best yeah. get in the other side. Don't yeah. You? because I think it's lower this side, isn't it? Goes right down to the floor. Oh yeah, that's a massive garage, isn't it? It's a great space. Yeah. Yeah, so what were you saying? Scooters and things in here? Yeah, scooters, bikes. Yeah. Uh, anything like so you've got your tie downs. Yeah. Running down both sides as yeah. well. Yeah. For locating. Yeah. Uh, and then again, they've just put, we've just put the, uh, the awning wine in hand yeah, in there. Yeah, it's as always well, useful to so have that to hand. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so it's all fully equipped and it's Omnistore. It is, that's right. With the full, yeah, the full satellite on it. Uh, she's not teleco, teleco satellite as well. So is that a dual feed one? Uh, it is, twin satellite, twin, L twin LMB, should I say. Yeah, excellent. Right, so what they've also got here on Time Valley Motorhome stand is the Eldis, their signature. And this is their um, dealer special. And this is a signature, an uh, Eldis signature 194. And it's in their own company colours. Nice alloys. They're 15 inch alloys, aren't they? Yep. Yeah. That's a very smart looking motor, this. I like that. Smart, isn't it? Yeah. The water point and that's an outdoor outside shower so they've got all nice things like that haven't they so yeah. an out outside shower on it yeah. they put a lot of extra kit on on this van nice big garage and then you've got double bed the well. Oop, way then. <laughs> that way that's it i think it comes with a bike as well oh. <laughs> this does doesn't it doesn't it come with I don't, show I don't know, is it a show offer? Yeah, I oh, think right, it's okay. a free uh, It's a little fold away bike. bike, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Is it electric? I'm not sure it's a... Oh, yes it is, it's got a little hub motor. Yeah. Oh, excellent. It's got tie-down... Uh, and you've got tie-down points there, obviously, to keep it, keep it safe. <laughs> so what we've got here, reversing camera back and gas lockers just behind there There's a gas barbecue outside right, point yeah. awning solar panel you can see up there yeah well Again, these vans, this is an ad blue one, isn't it? So it's a Peugeot, but it's a Peugeot, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, so this is not the 6B one. So, this most of the vans they've got here, I think he said, were 6B ones. So, what all of this for 46,495 with a free with two free e bikes? bikes. Yeah, two free ones. Wow, that's worth looking at, isn't it? Yeah. Somewhere to put your umbrella in the doors. All right. Okay, so it's a twin sofa layout. Yeah. So it's only obviously two, two um, driver and passenger. 
Yeah. So you couldn't take any one. Oh, is it the one with the, the pull-out seats? You unbutton that in there. Yeah. Well, it is, yeah, isn't it? it? Is, yeah. yeah. Yeah, we won't do that. Danger! I must admit, we had mixed feelings about these uh, travel seats, didn't we, under the sofa? Yeah. It does yeah. mean that you lose a bit of storage, but you can have them removed if you don't want them. Yeah. I mean, obviously yeah. they're useful if you want to take someone else but yeah I didn't have no. tested no <laughs> that's right I know that, I, no unless you really need to take four people yeah. with you I'd, I'd have those taken out but I suppose you've got the garage for storage with this yeah you? you've got a big garage storage area so I suppose you're not missing out on storage yeah so that goes quite a way in there there's under there Again, be beds are on slats. Mm. That's a great idea. You've got extra great. storage there as well. Steps up. They've actually got that thing in there, so I think you'd need a little ladder there. You move that out of the way. And then out of the way, and then I can get up there. Yeah, it's a little bit low for me. This yeah. Yeah, it is, isn't it? It's quite a high bed. It's quite a big garage, I suppose that's why. Yeah. Yeah. USBs at the back. Reading light. Nice headboard. I'll just put that back. That's it. I'll just put that back. There we go. <laughs> it's never easy doing this with one hand, you know. more locker space there as well let's have a look at the kitchen then so grill and oven mm. yeah very nice it's that same hob we saw in the other Aldis isn't it yeah so really a nice, nice black colour electric hot plate three burn gas uh, the black sink matching sink yeah and the best thing of all Russell Hobbs microwave Turn that light off. A rust Hobbs microwave. Which nicely blends in with the black look of the it does, kitchen, doesn't it? doesn't it? Yeah. 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 Nice cupboards. Yeah. Oh, that plug. Is that plug for the microwave? Yeah, that'd be yeah. for the microwave. Your plate rack there. Yeah. Don't think you'll fall in love with the fridge, but. No, it's, it's the manual energy it's selection favorite, and uh, yeah. <laughs> ignition, spark ignition. And like someone said, you get used to it. <laughs> I'll get over it. You'll get over it. The, it's a the nice little, yeah, the nice little drawers, aren't they? Yeah. And it feels solid. I'm going to open them all now. Well, I mean, just just for <laughs> comparison, they're all about the same same, same size, size, apart yeah. from the one at the top. I'm not going to go in here first. Let me just go in here. Okay. Good job. Right, table in here. And it's it's a table that you can take outside. Right. Always always extra points for that one. This has got a um, aerial and a splitter unit there for TV in the bedroom and at the back. Yep, that's good. That's just a sort of magnetic catch um, door there. Midships bathroom, again a bit of a wet room, reasonable size, with lockers, got one of those, um, they're called orbit shower heads, round things, bit of wheel arch intrusion, reasonable size sink, mm. no I think it's a bit small that mm, sink. Yeah I'm never a great fan of those No those stick up ones, no. 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 But what you have got above your head is an extractor fan. An extractor a nice touch. The, I mean, yeah, I really like having an extractor fan. We had one in the uh, a yeah, Starfire, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. I've had one since, but that was really, really yeah. nice. Yeah. So there's a lot of kit on here yeah. for not a lot of money. No, yeah, it's nice. And it's a nice light area in here. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Very light. You've got no. Um, oh, you've got cab lines. Got cab lines, cab and, lines and, and a curtain. Yeah. Yeah. And it's a long curtain again. Goes down to the floor. Down. Turn that light off. 
yeah it goes all the way down to the floor yeah so reversing camera light um, screen there yeah. TV in here yeah 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 and a little table pop-up flappy thing maximum weight six kilograms so don't go sitting on it no sunroof there sunroof there yeah Persia, isn't it? And it? Yeah, it's Persia. It's a different sort of colour in the cab, isn't there? Like, um, I haven't really seen this before. I suppose this must be on the newer models. It's like a. Or is it to match the. It, oh, screen? it might be a, a surround to match yeah. the, the set there, scheme. Steering wheel controls, good to see. Cup holders, USB. All good. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah, not bad. No, it's not good. bad. Right, so this is a Rymor Super Brig. Super Brig, and this yeah. is on the new engine, isn't it? The 140 engine. Oh, is it? Yeah. This is a Super Brig 687TC Rymor. Over cab. Locker outside, gas locker. Nice alloys. Toilet locker. And a big garage. It's a huge garage, isn't it? Yeah, it's not open, is it? Uh, probably got them. No. No, it's locked. <laughs> Push it in, that's it. No reversing camera. It's quite a surprise for a van this size. I definitely want a reversing camera on it. Let's have a look inside. Lots of muddy footprints in here, unfortunately. So this is 59,015. So it comes with a 130 brake horsepower engine, six speed manual gearbox, alloy wheels, air conditioning, cruise control, central locking, dab radio. It's four berth, four belted seats, rear transverse double bed. 3,500 kilograms. Doesn't say what the payload is. It's 7.18 meters and 3.08 meters high. So quite a big van. Yeah. Oh. Just seen the fridge. Just seen the fridge. That's yeah, it. We to <laughs> do this all day. Oh, we? Lovely. Wow. I really want one with a fridge <laughs> like this. It's brilliant, that. Yeah. All right, sold. That's it, right. Don't need to see any more. No. <laughs> no, this is a very nice van. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, I'd, I'd be worried about... I would be worried about the payload. Yeah. But uh, look at the size of the bed up there. Yeah, yeah my dear. Yeah. 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 Even for a... Even for a, a person of limited <laughs> stature. <laughs> That's it, thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's a bit... Yeah. Well, you know you, you're under it when you're under it. Yeah, I think you've got like a rear-facing travel seat, some arrangement there, possibly. It's a nice lounge. Yeah, there's plenty of space here, isn't there? Leg room, wise. A folding table. I mean, I'm not a great fan of these fixed tables, but at least the ones that fold like this, mm. it gives you so much more room. You've got an L-shaped sofa and travel seats there. A little bit weird with that sort of lumber cushion there, isn't it? See, yeah. what, see what I mean? This yeah. cushion there. You'd take that out if you don't want to. Yeah, I suppose so. I suppose if you're not using it as a travel seat. Oh, it's a bit upright, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. It? yeah, yeah. I'll open at least one locker. Nice hinges. Oh, oh look at the hinges. Yeah. Yes, yeah. soft clothes. It's a nice big sofa here. Tellies over here, and I've got your controls over here. What's that? Oh, it's a 12 volt socket there. I'll get that back in there. It's a rubber bung. And trimmer blown air. I like the mirrors in here, don't I? Of mirrors, hanging hooks. 
they've got this like um, porthole idea, haven't they, with these fans? Yeah. Not sure. <laughs> Not sure if that's completely necessary, but, but different. <laughs> it's a little signature, isn't it? I guess. Smoked. Um, by folding doors. That is quite. That's quite stylish. A little black shower head oh. and a black surround on the shower unit. Tiny little drain hole there. Just a minute drain hole. This mirror slopes back. Reusable sink. I always find this a bit weird when the, the particularly Continental vans want to put mains power in a bathroom just below the sink. Mm. What's going on in their heads? <laughs> Lots of places to hang things and store things there. There's like little rails there, towel rails, little cubby holes. That was the reason for this van is the, the lengthways bed. I was surprised. I thought that was going to be a two, you know, high up singles in there. No. Yeah, let's have a look underneath. Slats, that's yeah. good. Yeah. I have a feeling. That this one goes up and down because you've got like a bit of a curtain oh there, so you can probably raise it. It's like a bunk, you know. Yeah. It's got that whole sort of nautical feel to it, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah, it has. Yeah, like you're on a ship. Like you're on a ship. Yeah, yeah. I suppose hence the sort of the brig. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably it. Yeah. Yeah. So they've got a bit of a theme going, haven't they? Yeah. This here. Yeah. Hang on. <laughs> Don't get out of it. No, but you're a bit troubled. Yeah. Well, no, it's, it's just that there's quite a lip there. Yeah. Right, this, I mean, yeah. you know, I've seen a drawer quite like this. You've got this huge drawer there. Yeah. And then this comes out. Wow. On top. Wow. So that's for your That cutlery. is the biggest cutlery drawer I have ever seen. Yeah. That is so that, huge, isn't that it? That is amazing. So that yeah. goes back in. Yeah, so you can put. So you put things here. You couldn't put much very deep there, isn't it? No, no. Plates and plates things and like that. Yeah. Yeah. And that just closes. What's at the bottom there? There's another big, big dr drawer there. Big drawer. That's a good size drawer, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. But no oven. No oven. No oven. So, so when you lose the oven, yeah, you gain gain space. It says it's shut here at that cover. Just give that a push. Yeah, this is one I've never You never quite got the liked. idea of, of the three burner hole? No, well I just found that if I put something on the middle that was it. Yeah. I couldn't really use the others. Yeah. How often do you use three three pounds though? Normally two, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. If, well I'll use a microwave yeah. a lot, so there isn't one, is there? No. So that's that's your only uh, cooking thing. Yeah. I'm switching back to the wardrobe. Yeah. That's okay, it's not very deep, it only goes to about there. And a bit more storage underneath. Yeah. It's different. It is different, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's got the fridge, so you know, you'll forgive it anything. Yeah, yeah. I do like those fridges. <laughs> you want one of those fridges? Yeah. I don't mind, I'll keep our van. Yeah, and just change the fridge. Change the fridge. I've been looking at all the uh, the new vans. And this is a um, Compass Avant Garde 140. So on a Peugeot. This is very um, 90s, isn't it? Well, actually, it's 2007. Is it? Yeah. Looks very 90s, isn't it's it? With compass. a uh, sort of orange wood. Yeah. So what is it? It's a Compass Avant Garde 140, sales price 19,995, 2.2 .2 turbo diesel, 71,000 miles, 5 speed manual, central lock, electric windows, steering wheel control, it's 4 berth, 2 travel seats, and a big lounge at the back. Yeah. And it's a 3,300 kilogram van, 6.3 metres long. It's not bad in here, is it? Caravan. Uh, yeah, caravan thing. storage thing. 
<laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Nice table. Yeah. Different. Some lockers underneath. Yeah. Some old school controls here. Look at that. An actual dial. And an old that's an old fashioned twelve volt. Our first van had that. <coughs> had that sort of socket. Remember the, the thing for the water so being a, a rat. Yeah, that, that, that that's the ultra, ultra store controls. They're didn't still around, yeah. Didn't you have to take off something outside? Did yeah, you, you have to take the cowl off. Yeah, when you and if you the didn't, gas. that would come that on would, with a red light. It comes on with a red light, that's yeah. right. Yeah. We've got TV point on here. It's got a little um, pop up table. Yeah. Something to store your extra cup uh, cushions. Oh, a nice size wardrobe. It's not a bad size wardrobe, is it? So the heating's by the fire, isn't it? Like, remember we had that? Cupboard. You, the reason I always like opening cupboards is it gives you a feeling of what the van's like build-wise. Yeah, that's right. You know, how solid are the cupboards? Do the hinges fall off? Or this all seems pretty good. A little bit wear in the yeah, in hinges, but lot, yeah, of course they have. <laughs> that wallpaper there is exactly like we had in the Starfire. Yeah. I had that idea of wallpapered bathrooms in there. With mm. it. Flip, you even got the flip down sink. Oh, have they? Yeah. Yeah. Bench toilet, Thetford bench toilet. Shower curtain around there. Yeah. Perfectly usable. Oh, look at the fridge. It brings yeah. back memories. Oh Same sort of trim, wasn't That's it? That's the lock, isn't it? That yeah. One? yeah. Yeah. Sure, we had this fridge. Mm. Exact same fridge. Yeah. Ought to, ought to start a Dometic fridge museum, shouldn't they? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Is that a pull-out? Little pull-out on the table. Don't, yeah. It only goes that far. Is it? Oh, no. Yeah, pull it yeah. hard enough. I don't want to pull it too hard. Oh, get back, get back. Oh, nice little thing for the kitchen towel. Yeah, something to hold your kitchen towel. Sink looks nice and clean. Mm. Stuff of th thinking it's done like 71,000 miles. Yeah, it's quite nice. Yeah. Yeah, sort of oven, combi oven. Yeah, with a grill. Yeah. Yeah. This could be a little, little bargain for someone. Mm, it's 19,995. 19,995, just under 20. M&C Limited. We've got this one. Yeah, hull. And uh, yeah, you've got the steering wheel controls on this per this Peugeot, but it is obviously the old style. Uh, it's not the oldest style, is it? So this is like the Mark II, isn't it? Great big double bed at the, the back. Yeah. Great big sweeping space there. Just use that, couldn't you? I remember we had, had a light like this to oh, yeah. reach up for the switch. Yeah, the little switch there. That's the on and off switch there. Yeah. Yeah. This really brings back memories because this is, this is crazy really because that's a CD changer that we had. Yeah. A 10, di 10 disc Sony CD changer. Behind the passenger Behind seat. Behind the passenger seat, exactly there. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's in the CD player in the front. Yeah. So yeah, it is the newest style uh, Peugeot boxer, but uh, ours was the even older boxer, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah. But yeah, and even the fire. Even the fire. The trimmer. Well, we had that in the first two, didn't we? Okay. Traumatic, that's what they called it, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. first two vans had that. Yeah. I just assume that's what you always had, you know, yeah. you know things that old do. Yeah, so don't discount vans like this. There's still plenty of life left in this. Yeah. When you say 71,000 miles, you think, well, that's a lot. But these vans were designed to do 200 plus yeah. thousand miles. Yeah, it's even got it under the extras. So this is a Pioneer oh, CD. Oh, it's a Pioneer red. one, is it? No, but the actual CD changes the Sony one. Well, sh well it, looks like, it looks like the Sony. Yeah, so if you're thinking you can't afford a motor, just think about an older one, a classic one. 
something you could look after, a little project. Yeah. Look, look at a big window. The, look at a massive window here. It's yeah. great, isn't it? Yeah. Three of them. Mm. I wonder what the seats are like. Not bad. No. Considering right. it's you know, it's age and Yeah. It's a great place to be on a windy windy day in yeah. Thursk. No, a windy wet day in Thursk. Yeah, so just I said I'd look at this because it, I, you know, it's VW, so it's got a bit of interest for VW owners. It's an Auto Sleeper Clubman GL. It's got a monocoque body, so it doesn't rot. Right, fiber, fiberglass body. They made. They only made a few of these, didn't they? And they were now extremely popular. I know. Yeah. Recently, they they released another one, like a, this, like a an anniversary anniversary one, edition. Though. That's it. Yeah, but we used to see when we first started. We see loads of them. Loads of them. Yeah. You know, and it's a solid thing, isn't yeah. it? You know, and it's not much bigger than than a little um, transporter van itself. It's got an awning on it. Yeah, it's got awning on it. Really nice furnishings. Oh, look inside and you've got all the really nice auto sleeper cupboardry this is a sweet little van <laughs> yeah VW up the front looks like it's got a reversing camera over cab bed so you don't have to make up the bed if you don't want to I think I might make up the bed for me though it looks a little bit small for me <laughs> Yeah, well, it's simple to make it. Yeah, up you've got a ta together. tables that you've put in there. Yeah, great big windows. Look at the size of the windows. Yeah, yeah, both sides. And at the back. Yep. Great views out. Mm. Got to open at least one locker, haven't I? Not bad size lockers, but considering this is the size of a panel van. Mm hmm. Yeah, you've got your table legs in there, your awning winder, little shelf, hanging space. Oh, that fire. Yeah. Wow. It's yeah. vintage, isn't it? It's a carver. A carver. A fire. Yeah. yeah. Inevitable fridge. Now, this, this is, is like a, the very first fridge we yeah, had. Yeah, this is like the, the Vista's fridge, yeah. wasn't it? I think you had to make sure that was locked, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, there's a button or something you release. Yeah. I can't remember how you do it. You no, I think it should have. That's like that. Here. There you go. Yeah. Once you've figured out how to get in it, it's a yeah. It's a reasonable size fridge. We always just have to make sure we lock it. You've got to it, make sure we? that that's down that button. Can mm. you see it? Can you see it? Yeah. And that's the lecky. That was. That's right. That's the battery, wouldn't it? Yeah, and the gas ignition's over here. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Electronic ignition. Yep. And that's. Uh, that's your wine cupboard. Wine cupboard. We had one of those, didn't we? Yeah. One of the vans. Yeah, only three bottles in there. That's better. I see it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Have you got a fan up there? Oh no, that's yeah, like the. Is that yeah. an extractor fan? Yeah, it is. Yeah. So I looked in there, haven't I? Yeah, that must be the bathroom. So this must shower be the room in shower there. room, yeah. I keep calling it a bathroom, it's not a bathroom. Bench toilet drop down sink <laughs> yeah just pulls down you do what you need to do it then you tip it up and all the water's gone yeah <laughs> it's the same it is the same unit that was in the, the Vista, the Vista. Yeah. yeah 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 everything here seems to be in a cupboard yeah yeah I think this lifts up yeah and there's your sink you've you got your sink yeah and you're cooking they go, so, they go they together, go, yeah. Yeah, they go. Yeah. I think you've got sure to push they them stay back. Up. There's like a clip somewhere. Is that? Yeah, look, can you see there? Over there. Oh, right, yeah. You'd put that up like that. Must be on this. See them on That's this it. side. And then you'd, you'd open up this sort of thing here. Like it's that. complicated. It's right. a bit complicated once it's done, though. <laughs> like that. So does that one? That's it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So yes, it's <laughs> it's a very, very simple two burner thing, but 
This is a really nice classic van. Yeah, it is classic, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Let me take that off there. Yeah, it's the final one. Oh, it's there. It's on yeah, the curtain. Yeah. yeah. There's your controls. It's just a. Uh, yeah, well, you can put, you'll put your forks in there and a thing. And your cupboards underneath. Yeah. I'm going to go stepping out in a minute. We'll turn around when you go out. <laughs> but yeah. This would be a lot of fun. Yeah, somebody's put it in a radio, haven't they? <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. How much did they want for it? Didn't say, does it? He said same nineteen. It's nineteen nine five. five. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. if you're looking for a classic, this is a classic. It's definitely a classic. Yeah. It's got a labcraft, labcraft light. Now, a clock. <laughs> <laughs> I like this a lot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, take this to the classic shows, couldn't you? Yeah. The toilet cassette, I think, there, isn't it? Yeah, I would imagine so. Yeah. Shower yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> Gas locker. Gas locker. That's your carver heater outlet. I'm told that these are getting difficult to find, aren't they? The carver heater units. Yeah. No, I enjoyed that. It's good. I'm not just saying that because I want people to come to the show for Aiden's <laughs> stand, <laughs> stand. But uh, no, it's been good in spite yeah. of the rain. It's been really nice looking around. Yeah. Ch it's talk different to sort of vans, aren't they? Yeah, different vans, yeah. and we've chatted to quite a few people as well. Yeah, it's been nice. Yeah. So, yeah. so we're going to head back see what how much footage I've, I've got, got here. Get yeah. Poppy. Get Poppy. Rescue Poppy from Glyn. <laughs> <Glyn. laughs> In case he decides to keep her. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so if you like what you see, give us a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe as always. And we'll catch up with you on the next one. Yeah. Okay, see you then. then. Bye then.